Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. Stay tuned. We'll have all the action for you live here on EA TV. Hello and welcome. This is the scene here at Molyneux. I'm Derek Ray on the commentary gantry and delighted to be joined as always by Stuart Robson. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It's Wolverhampton Wanderers up against Aston Villa. Well, thanks Derek as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. The initial 11 for Wolves. Johnny starts with Nelson Semedo in the wide defensive areas. Ruben Neves plays alongside João Moutinho in central midfield. And they line up with just the one striker looking to do a bit of damage. Iaramendi in a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Johnny. Well, keeping the opposition at bay is something Wolves have done with relish this season. The record, Stuart, is magnificent. Well, they've been so well organised defensively. They press the ball from the front, the midfield players work really hard, and the defence are so disciplined. They're just so hard to break down. Good work to regain possession. Johnny. Pedro Neto. Neves couldn't keep the ball John McGinn and here is Mings Vital Simba Sanson Fortunis has it Iaramendi Sanson. It's with Iaramendi. Very comfortable when in possession. Konstantinos Fortunis. Well, the keeper had plenty to think about with bodies around him. Takes aim. And he read it really well. Fine save. Playing it in. Not too fussy in clearing his lines. Crisp tackling. Neto. It's with Moutinho. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Surely! Oh, magnificent reaction. Well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area. Ings. Fortunis has it. Well, oh, they've given him too much space. Yaramendi. Oh, a tremendous block. Martinho. I must say this looks promising. Oh, what an opportunity. Brilliant save. Sanson. Constantinos Fortunis. He's enjoying space. And there it is, the half-time whistle.
plenty to consider based on what we've seen so far as the second half begins. Holding. It's with Morgan Sanson. Iaramendi. And here is Mings. Konstantinos Fortunis. McGinn. Well, no doubt many of you have been hearing the transfer rumours. It does look as though the deal could be on, Stuart. Well, according to the reports, the official bid is around about £100 million, which I think is a good deal. It's just a case of whether Wolves find it acceptable. We should know over the next couple of days. Ings. Konstantinos Fortunis. Running with the ball confidently. Neves. And danger still. But it looks so threatening, but the danger averted. Well, I still don't know how he kept that out, Derek. It's a fantastic save to keep it all square. Just a quick reminder, we'll have action from the Carabao Cup coming up live here on EA TV. It's Aston Villa taking on Leicester City. Well, it's great to have a break from the league for the players and the fans. Everybody loves this competition, and so do I. It should be a good game. Committed challenge. Read it well. Just 20 minutes remaining now. Konstantinos Fortunis. Ings. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Diaramendi. The end product just wasn't there. Ruben Neves. Well, let's see if something comes of this. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Offside. Well, he doesn't need to make his movement quite so quickly there. Just let the ball be played into the space. Substitution time it is here. Sanson. Iaramendi. Offside. Close one. Ten minutes to go. Oh, he's given the ball away. Well, the atmosphere is so tense inside this stadium, but can Villa find that moment of magic to win this game? The crowd certainly thinks so. Just listen to them. Five minutes of the 90 still to go, and the teams cannot be separated. Can he put them in front? Well, here it is again, and just look how he turns away from his marker and then gets his shot away. That's a very good goal, you have to say. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Konstantinos Fortunis. Down by a goal. This could be the final opportunity to snatch something. Well, this late corner could represent their last chance to equalise. 
still danger here. And this might not be the ideal situation for them. Can they keep it out? And he clears it out of harm's way. And the referee blows the whistle. Wolves get the victory and take the three points. What did you make of it all? Yes, Derek, sometimes it takes a while to eventually get the better of the opposition. And that was the case here. They kept going and they eventually got their reward.